This is not, this is not working. We're gonna just keep my arm here. Anyways, I genuinely do not know where to start. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Emma and today we have a lot of work in store for us. So I'm moving up from college where I had a single dorm room all to myself to a room that is considerably smaller. I've never had this room before prior to moving into college and so I've definitely collected a lot of things and bought things for my larger room. And so I got a new room over Christmas break back at my house and so it's gonna be such a struggle trying to fit everything from my large dorm room into my tiny room. So let's get into this video. Make sure you follow my socials, Legit Emma Baker, pretty much everywhere. I've moved a lot of the boxes up. Keep in mind, I had to rent a U-Haul trailer that I shared with my boyfriend. So I had half a U-Haul trailer full of stuff. Um, my roommate from fall semester though, I do have some of her stuff because she let me keep some of it. So with that in mind, so I didn't like overpack, but. So that is why we have a lot of stuff already in my room, but I can fit the span of my room in this camera. So keep that in mind. I genuinely do not know where to start. So what would solve a lot of problems is making my bed right now, but I wanted to use my comforter and everything that came from my dorm room because it's much comfier, but that got left to my boyfriend's house last night when we unloaded his part of the trailer. So that's an issue that we're trying to overcome right now. Apparently I decided to like rob every single Hobby Lobby around during school because I've collected a plethora, I don't even know if that's a word, of signs. I have a signs galore. I have paddles. I have three paddles for my sorority this year. I have so much stuff to literally just like hang up and put up that I have no idea. So this stuff actually came like with my room or I bought it like over Christmas break, but I needed to put my TV there. So everything that was on my TV stand at the foot of my bed is um, <laughs> not there anymore. So that's all here. So we have that to work with. So um, I think I'm gonna tackle my desk first. In order, in order to tackle my desk, I have to tackle the shelf above the desk, which is all clean, but everything pretty much has to go from the shelf above my desk because I have to put signs there. Like it's literally gonna look like you walked into a Hobby Lobby store when you walk through my room. But you know what? There could be worse things in the world. There could be worse things. So I think that's what we're gonna do first. I literally have no clue where to put this camera. I am not a vlogger. I don't know how they get all like the cool like little angles because I literally, like how am I supposed to put you guys? I cannot believe I actually look like this. Like, anyways, um, so I got it complete, not completely done yet, um, but I'm going to bring up more tubs which have more signs in it and probably more books. I did take some books out, but a lot of these books like I utilize or I'm a big journal person. I like to buy journals, whether I use them or not, that doesn't really matter, but I like to buy journals. And so I have quite a few of journals up here. Um, but that being said, I forgot to add that I also have an office down in my basement that some of my things are probably gonna go into. It's kind of like my backup plan because I have a business, I have a jewelry company, and I have a desk in my room now, so I can I can actually run my business upstairs, but I do have a whole office space down in the basement with other desks and chairs and stuff. So if things do not fit here, like my mini fridge and all of that stuff, um, I can definitely move it downstairs. So we're not like super tight, but I also like would love to have all my stuff in my room, like my other room, because I loved my Carbondale room. I went to SIU, if you didn't see my previous video, and I loved my room. I'm probably out of storage soon. I also like to talk with my hands, so I'm gonna refrain from doing that, but we are making progress. That is all that matters, is we're making progress. Don't look at the other side of my room. It's scary. But this side, we're good. Okay, so the problem is like, I'm relying on so many things, but I'm like, I'm at like a standstill because I need my bed to be made so I can like put things on my bed, but like everything is just like so chaotic. I mean, literally look. That's my bed right now, guys. That is my bed. So chaotic. I have a bunny. So whenever you see like hay in my room, like a bag of hay, don't think I'm weird, okay? I have a bunny, but she lives in my room right now, but she's getting an outdoor hutch. So dilemma number two, where she has her like tub right now or her like enclosure, I guess, is where I want to move my dresser, but I can't move my dresser until she's out, but we're not building the hutch until next week. But to get this, so where I want to move my dresser is in my closet right now, but I want to move my hut or I want to move my dresser to like buy my TV stand. But that's where Piper, my bunnies, 
tub is but I have a container that I want to put in my closet instead so that way I can utilize my entire closet to hang up things because when my dress is in my closet I can only hang up things on the side of each of my dressers so big dilemma that I don't know how to handle so I don't know if Piper's just gonna live downstairs um but I also don't want to do that because my sister's graduating and she's having a graduation party and the graduation party is happening before we build the hutch so Piper needs to be upstairs so oh my goodness what am I gonna do because I want everything like done because I am here for like two and a half months and I don't want to spend a month of it moving in just to move back out again but I'm gonna run out of storage and I like to talk and I'm like death gripping this right now so we're gonna figure out what's going on we gotta figure this out also, if you made it this far in this video, wow, very proud because no one else watched my last video. Um, but I am not a YouTuber whatsoever, but I'm also going to be kind of bored this summer. Hopefully kind of bored. So, um, give me like tips and tricks on like how you like or what you like want a video on because I don't think about making videos because I like this is not something I think of, but it's like kind of fun for me. You know, it's like kind of like a friend that like doesn't talk back to me. It's kind of cool. But I like want to make more videos because it's kind of fun. I loved editing. It actually took way too long to edit for like four people to watch my video. So thank you to the four people, including like my friend and my boyfriend that watched it. Because um, anyways, so give me like tips and tricks on like how to like film or like how to like what do you guys want to like see in my video? Like it doesn't even have to be like video ideas. It's like what do you like is the lighting suck? Like yeah, the lighting sucks right now. So like probably should I change that? I don't know. Like kind of help me with that if you guys make it to this part in the video. It is kind of discouraging whenever I spend like hours editing and then not a single person watches it. Very fun. So I don't know if it's like not what people want to see or what because like I don't watch YouTube either so I don't even know why I'm posting it. But anyways, so moving on. All right, so I just got done with another tub. Um, a lot of it was kitchen stuff, so I was able to put it in a separate tub that I'm just keeping for next year because I'm living in an apartment next year, and so I obviously won't need it here. We love when there's kitchen stuff because then I can just put it in the tub. But anyways, also, I have no clue why it is so hot in my house or in my room specifically. My The rest of my house is like nice and cold, but my room is so hot and I mentioned earlier that I don't have a box fan right now because in the tiller box at my boyfriend's house with the rest of my sheets and stuff I was thinking about taking everything off my bed and then just taking all the sheets off so it's like a flat surface to like put things on it because I'm going to get my other sheets I just don't know like where to start like I've started but I don't know where to like go from here because like I'll be working on something and then I have to put something like an item somewhere else but that place needs clean so I'll start working on that so it's totally not an org it's like organized chaos in here like, I know where everything needs to go now. I have kind of have, like, an idea and a picture of it. But how to get there, I'm working on. Like, I seriously don't know. Also, my lighting's about to get really trash because it's going to get dark soon. So, I apologize for that. Alright, so I found all the command hooks. So, now we can finally start hanging things up and get the desk cleaned off so then I can put stuff on the desk so I don't know how many command hooks that we have but we're gonna ration and we're gonna get there because I just want this all to be done and my family's not gonna come home for a little bit so um I'm stranded here so let's try to get this all done not sound like it's sticking so I really hope that it stays why is it not staying it's gonna fall it's gonna fall did you guys hear that oh my gosh why is this not working okay so I'm calling in for some backup with these random like crappy sticky cube thingies that I found don't think it's gonna work but I also don't want my calendar falling like in the middle of the night because that would scare the absolute crap out of me oh so that's not gonna stay either what are we gonna do? Like this literally stayed in my dorm with the same like type of strips. So I don't know what is going on. Okay, so we're just gonna hope that that thing stays up. So now we're gonna move back to the desk and we're going to kind of clean off everything and then wipe it down and then only put back what I need on the desk. And then we can go from there because I genuinely don't know how everything's gonna fit on this desk. And it's gonna look a little cluttered and I hate clutter, but I, just don't want to box up all of this stuff because I don't have a place to put everything in a box so it's gonna have to stay on my desk for a couple months which is fine but I have a lot of stuff to put back on my desk so this is what we're working with not bad it's not bad Okay, 
right, so I knew this video was gonna be very all over the place, so we kind of got done with the desk. It's looking really good, um, but I'm missing some things, and I have no idea where they are. I think there's a tub that I'm missing somewhere, um, so I'm gonna start tackling the closet now. I have like epitome, or whatever it's called, that if I move the dresser out, I could hang up almost all of my clothes, and then my pants, I could just put in my drawer organizer that I was going to put other things in. So I don't even think I might need a dresser anymore. Um, so that kind of solves our second dilemma. So let's see how well this works. I've tried it once before in my old room and it didn't work. So we're going to see if maybe we can downsize, um, maybe store some clothes away or something. Because I do not wear much else than like athletic shorts and tank tops in the summer. So, and that's all I'm going to be here for. So I think that I can get away with having no dresser at all in my room. But we gotta play our cards right. Okay, so I'm finding out that in order to do one task, you might have to complete two other tasks to even get it done. So I'm trying to clean off my bed. That's my main task right now. Um, so I can sleep tonight because it's getting late and it's Mother's Day, so I'm going out to eat with my family tonight. And so I'm trying to clean off my bed. I have to clean off my bed so there's clothes on it. So I'm trying to get rid of the clothes and put them in my closet. To put them in my closet, I have to clean my closet out and get rid of my dresser so right now i had to clean i'm cleaning out this these bins right now and my goal is to put like my shorts and then maybe jeans um in these things and then get rid of my dresser in here so then i can hang up the rest of my clothes because as you can see i can't hang up things i can only hang up things like on the sides of my dresser um like on the sides of my closet around my dresser and that is not ideal so and I also don't have room to put my dresser out here in my room because my room is really small I'm stuck with a really tiny room and a big problem so that's what's going on right now I'm cleaning out this tub I'm cleaning to clean off my bed in order to clean off the tub and the dresser so long story short that is what I'm doing right now also, to clean out my closet, there are no angles to put it on, so just take my word for it that I'm cleaning out my dresser and my closet, because, yeah, how am I supposed to prop up a camera in there? Okay, so this looks horrible right now, but I honestly have no clue how it's going to look any better, because I need my dresser out, and everything fits in the little tiny things. I took some things out that I'm just going to give away, because I don't wear them, but it all fits, so I'm just going to, I'm just going to get rid of the dresser. Um, it all it's all working out so I know it looks terrible and disorganized but I also have an organizer underneath my bed that's empty so we're gonna utilize that later but I just need my floor to be clean to be able to do that and so that's gonna be the last thing that I do is probably reorganize what I'm doing but for the domino effect of everything that needs to get done today I'm just gonna put my clothes in the organizer bins and then put it in my closet so Yes, I know it looks really bad, um, and yes, it's going to get fixed, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to film it because it's probably going to be, like, in the next couple of days whenever I'm already editing the video, but um, just know that it's going to look better, I promise, um, but yeah, that's the way it's going to be right now. Hey guys, this is awkward. Um, this is my sister. So anyways, it's dark outside right now. Totally forgot to film a lot of what just happened, but I hung up a couple of things. I plugged in my TV, which was not hard because it's already set up. So I just plugged it in, plugged in the fire stick. Um, so it's all set up now for that. And then I hung up a lot of things on the wall. Okay guys, so it's the next day. Um, and I moved down my dresser, as you can see, it's a mess out there. Uh, but I moved down my dresser uh, this morning. And so that made a world of difference because now I can like move in my room and be able to like really organize and kind of see my room getting put together. My closet is almost done for the time being. It's not the way I want it, but I just want my all my room to be clean and then I can start working on like the smaller things and like organize. But um, at least it's not as chaotic as it was in here before. So right now, I'm going to work on honestly just taking everything off the floor, putting it um, like as I go through it, putting it on my bed, the stuff I just need to put in here but I don't know where. And I'm gonna vacuum all the carpet and all the floors just so I'm not tracking things everywhere. And then as I do that, I can kind of just like plan what I wanna do next. Um, so we're really coming along. It's been a process. It's been a lot more than I thought it would be. Alright, so I just got on vacuuming and I'm gonna take a breather real quick and so I'm going to do my calendar because I'm really tired of just moving around right now. Um, and I found my bag that's been missing this entire move-in process uh, that has like everything for my calendar in it, which is weird because I cleaned off my desk and it wasn't there. So I don't know where this appeared from, but it's here now. So we're going to go ahead and do my calendar. I also want to add that since this 
room used to be an office for my family. I have the Wi-Fi router and our home phone, I know, ancient, in my room right now. We're gonna get that fixed um, and then move it like to the other side of the wall where our hallway is. But yeah, so if you guys see, like I'm trying to like hide it behind there because I don't wanna look at it, it's an like, eyesore, but um, if you guys see that in the corner, that's what's going on there. Also bear with me with the iPhone quality camera. I have a camera and it's a really nice camera, but for some reason I can't import videos to my phone and MacBook for my camera, only pictures. So if you guys have an idea on what I'm doing wrong, please let me know because it's a Canon camera and it is great quality and it'd be a lot better than this. And I have a tripod and everything, but I cannot for the life of me get videos. So please let me know um, what the heck is going on. But anyways, to the calendar. So it's a couple of days later and my room is completely done and I could not be happier with it. So I'm gonna show you guys a little montage. this video i loved making this video i loved every single part of this and a lot of it actually surprised me on how much i was able to fit in this tiny little room so thank you for joining me on this crazy adventure i definitely plan on making a lot more content in the future for you guys i travel a lot in the summer so i'm going to be doing a lot of travel vlogs a lot of travel content which is super exciting also i move back in a couple of months and i'm going to be shopping for my apartment so i'd love to take you guys along and do all of that stuff. So please like and subscribe. It's really, really encouraging to see all of that. And I also really enjoy editing videos, but it does take a little bit. So it is really encouraging to see some support. So please comment below anything you wanna see because I would love to get you guys' feedback and make a bunch of content for you guys. I'm here for the next two and a half months um, and then I start back in college and I'll make more content for you guys then. So thank you guys and see you next time.